welcome to Sukshma Technologies. Now I am going to demonstrate a project called Secure Wireless Two-Way Data Communication. And uh, here we are using a microcontroller. The data input is given from the PS2 keyboard, and the display uh, used is 16 by 2 LCD display, alpha numeric. And we are making use of a RF transceiver here, and uh, we have similar circuit here with the same components microcontroller and PS2 keyboard RF transceiver and the data will be received and displayed on LCD display here. So both the users here can communicate using this device and it supports two-way communication. Let us look at its features. It supports point-to-point -point communication and two-way communication support, store and forward. So the type of data is buffered then sent to the peer and it supports uh, encryption and decryption uh, this is a very good feature here it supports uh, the encryption which almost cannot be determined by anybody who is trying to hack the data in between and uh, the encryption mode can be enabled or disabled by the user now let us see its operation these two are the devices, the user 1 and user 2. We are using a PS2 keyboard as input device and a microcontroller setup. And this is the RF transceiver and LCD display. Similarly, here we have a keypad, keyboard, a microcontroller, RF transceiver and LCD. Let us power it on. Let me power on the other board as well. It displays M2M secure two way wireless data communication. And it, here it is asking me to whether to enable the encryption or not. Similarly, the other kit also asking the same. Let us try with encryption mode enabled. So we need to press the key Y here. Data encryption enabled. Similarly, I am pressing the key Y here. It says data encryption enabled. Now let me send some data. I am just typing hello h e l l o nothing is being received here now once i press enter key then only the data will be transferred to the other end data is transferred and here the data is cleared the hello is being displayed here on the first row Suppose here I am typing hello space there. I just typed hello there and it should be displayed over the receiver end. I am just pressing enter here. Once I press enter, the bottom line cleared and here in the top row it, it got displayed hello there. Suppose I am entering S double O X M A Sokshma. Suppose T E C H. If I want to delete this, I can use backspace. Suppose if I want to send Sokshma.com. Okay, the data got buffered and it got edited within the buffer. And when I press enter, the Sokshma.com will get displayed over here. Now let us try disabling the encryption on one board. Suppose on this board, let me reset this board. Want to enable encryption? I say no. Data encryption disabled. Whereas the other board 
the encryption is enabled now if i send some data from here suppose 1 1 1 1 2 2 2 2 for example if i send if i say enter see the data received is something else it's not same even the first four characters here are same but uh, here it's not same suppose if i send a a a a four five a's but they got received the received characters are not same similarly if i send something from here suppose five four five and if i say enter see some of the number got received if i say hello enter see hello has been displayed like this suppose if i disable the encryption here itself on the receiver end also then the data communication should be fine i'm pressing no here data encryption disabled now on both the boards the data encryption is disabled now here if i send hello and press enter see the hello got received similarly if i send 1 2 3 4 5 6 4 1 2 3 4 5 and if i press enter 4123 and uh, this project can be extended to multi point communication means the kits like this can be multiple within the building and multiple users can communicate using this keyboard and the microcontroller based application and the data is been taken care the data transfer is being done by this wireless transceivers and the distance the travel distance is been uh, limited by this device for example this device supports approximately 30 meters and uh, if you want you can extend the data using uh, the modules like xb pro which supports uh, around 1 uh, kilometer and uh, we need to make little modifications uh, for uh, multi point communication because here we are not mentioning the peer address whereas in case of multi point communication the peer's address to whom we are sending the data so the address should be entered thank you for watching the demo